Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the 16th, okay? Uh, then I'm going to get started on my next segment, which is going to be September. I'm going to do that one a little bit differently. We're going to do past, present, future, and how your person or how somebody, I don't know, whoever's strongest in your energy is thinking about you, okay? So that's going to be started next, and uh, I just... Uh, started back up my other channel, Empress TV. The link is uh, in my community section. Also, in my, you'll see it on my front page if you're interested in checking that out. So what do we have for a message today? What do we have? And no, I'm not offering any private readings at this time. I've been getting a lot of requests. Nope, those are closed off. So what do we have for a message today? Six of Wands reversed. Six of Wands reversed is no victory, no progress. Hmm. Two of Swords reversed in the past. So there's some sort of blockage. Somebody has been blocking their own success. Oh, something is going to be exposed or that something has been exposed. Maybe something has been exposed, coming out of denial, you know, some sort of awakening here with the Two of Swords reversed, or decision has been made. There's no success, there's no victory. Ace of Cups reversed. Ooh. Four of Pentacles reversed, Nine of Wands reversed. There's an absence of success here. When you get all reversals, there is a reason for that. That means there's an absence or it's extremes. Another reversal. Page of Pentacles reverse. No commitment. Lack of commitment. Doesn't want commitment. Not interested in commitment. We have somebody here that's not interested in committing to something. They're not interested in putting in the effort. Um, they're letting go of something with the Four of Pentacles reversed. Uh, might be, a, might be, you know, uh, we have the Ace of Cups reverse, a lack of love, a loveless situation, not looking for love, not looking for a commitment. Um, it could be somebody here that is shutting down. They're just not putting in any effort at all. Um, oh, got the King of Wands just fell out. We also have the Page of Cups on the bottom, so there could be an offer of love that is coming, or somebody could be flirting, they could be um, initiating something. We may have an admirer here that is about to take action, but the Page of Pentacles reversed in the, in the future is like not committed. It's like somebody that may have a wandering eye that isn't really, really committed. So you may want, they may not be looking for love. They may not be looking for a relationship. Right next to it is the Knight of Wands reverse. This could be a, like a one hit wonder or a one night stand or somebody that doesn't really want responsibility. This person um, is probably very smug and cocky. Uh, maybe lack self-confidence, maybe has lost some of their power, lost some control. They want their control back or they want their power back. Uh, but they don't have any staying power. There's no staying power here. So I think that you have to be careful. Um, action. This is action. So I feel like we have somebody here that is about to take action. This is somebody that's action oriented. Um, Page of Cups, that is a message of love. A welcome, flirtatious message is coming. This is somebody that um, is going to be sending a message of love or something, or flirting, or, you know, this could, this could be a crush. Um, let's keep going. Four of Pentacles reverse is opening up. Somebody has been holding themselves back. They're going to be opening up. Justice. Justice is a card of balance. It's about integrity. It's about doing the right thing. Um, making a decision. Somebody is making a decision. 
Knight of Pentacles reverse. Whatever this decision is that they're making, there's still nothing solid, nothing stable. This person is not going to commit. Maybe you got to be honest with yourself. Somebody may need to be honest with themselves about something. Knight of Pentacles reversed is somebody that is probably not very qualified. Um, they may... Uh, Well, it's not very practical right next to the page of pentacles reversed as well this isn't solid it's not stable there's nothing real about this there's nothing real it's it's there's no in the knight of wands reversed there's definitely no staying power somebody's gonna have to make a decision they're gonna have to make a decision could be a spur of the moment decision um coming out of denial opening up somebody is opening up something they've been blocked by fear or they've been protecting themselves staying in a secure situation stepping out of their security zone making a fair and just decision speaking some things communicating with that ace of swords but with that ace of cups reverse it's like I'm not sure this is love it doesn't look like it's love because of that page of pentacles reverse that page of pentacles reverse is no commitment this is dropout this is a dropout somebody that quits when the going gets tough again with the knight of pentacles reverse this isn't you know definitely no staying power Whoever this person is, they may have some insecurities. They Maybe they need some attention. You know, the Knight of Wands reverse. That's somebody that probably needs some sort of attention. Maybe they're not getting the love they that they need someplace else. Eight of Cups. Eight of Cups is, you know, leaving behind some sort of emotional discontent. Saying goodbye making a decision to say goodbye. Somebody's going to say no, I believe, with the Knight of Pentacles reverse. There's no, no reason. Whoever this person is, they're lazy. There's laziness here. Seven of Swords. Let me just get one more. Ace of Swords. We have a dishonest and Ace of Swords reverse. Seven of Swords upright. We have a dishonest individual that is very cunning, very sneaky, very slippery. This person is not telling the truth. They they uh, don't tell the truth. This person um, is hiding something it feels like they they uh are leaving they may say that they've left something behind but it's not true and maybe they say that they've left they've walked away from somebody it's not true we also have somebody that's not looking where they're going they may run into somebody they may run into somebody spontaneously not sure the eight of cups next to the seven of swords if there's some sort of breakup here somebody somebody may say they're breaking up i'm not sure it's true though with the ace of swords reversed there's dishonesty here somebody's being dishonest they're not telling the truth they're not they're not really committed somebody could be getting out of a commitment but i mean the knight of wands reverse can be a sudden departure Somebody may be deciding to depart, depart something, you know, that they were feeling safe in because there's no love. They've been dishonest, but that justice is a card of realignment. It's also a card of karma. It's also a card of truth. So I feel, and the, and the sword is up. So there's some sort of truth that is coming
Nine of Wands reverse. We have somebody here that may be taking ownership. They're giving up. It feels like they've been dealing with some challenges, quite a bit of maybe karmic challenges, you know. Anyway, they've been dealing with some challenges. They may be angry, you know, and having a hard time struggling with all of the situations that they've been in. We have somebody here that is really, really struggling. They're overwhelmed. They may have reached a breaking point. Nine of Wands reverse. This is giving up. I feel like it's giving up, but I feel like it, I still feel like we have a very smug, cocky individual here. I do. This person thinks that they can do whatever they want. It's like, I can do whatever I want. There's some sort of dishonesty. There is. Somebody may have been cheating. Maybe they got caught with the Two of Swords reversed because that's lies being exposed. Maybe they've been let go and they're going in another direction really, really, really fast. That Knight of Pentacles is a stop in reverse. It's a stop. Stop. Somebody is stopping something. They're stopping. They're making a decision to stop going in some certain direction and they're leaving with that Eight of Cups. The, the justice is the decision. The Knight of Pentacles is stop. Eight of Cups going in another direction, leaving behind the emotional disappointment, going towards wish fulfillment. But that Seven of Swords, maybe this person has been planning, okay? Because the Seven of Swords is a planner. It really is. This is somebody that is very, very cunning, very intelligent, that usually succeeds in what they do because they think about it so much. But that Page of Pentacles reverse is like a dead end. It is a dead end. It's interesting because it feels like things are blurry you know I don't know it feels like things are blurry so things maybe have been blurry emotions may have been all over the place with the ace of cups reverse somebody may have been in their emotions in their feelings you know they're in it they're obviously uh, losing a battle they're losing they're losing with the six of wands reverse that's losing somebody is losing they're losing something They've been blocking their own success and they're losing. They're losing because they've been in denial, playing it safe. There could be a sudden departure here. Somebody could be saying goodbye to a cheater or to somebody that doesn't want commitment. Seven of Cups, exploring options, confused. There is somebody that has been confused. They've been exploring their options. They've been having a hard time making a choice. They have been. Deciding, on, because it's right on top of the Justice card. Somebody is deciding. They're thinking right now. They are definitely confused. It's like, oh my God, what do I do? What do I choose? There's so many options. There's, so, there's multiple choices here. So somebody uh, has been exploring their options. And they may, be, they may have a lot of pride. You know, we may have somebody here that has been in a situation that they haven't been able to walk away from because of pride with the Nine of Wands reversed. But there's going to be a change because the Two of Pentacles is a change. 
It's a realignment. It is. So there is going to be a change. We have somebody here that is making a decision. They've probably been dishonest with themselves. Not putting in any effort at all. To the dreams, maybe, because the Ace of Cups is reversed and that's dreams. Somebody has been ignoring their dreams. They've been, they have. And there's been some sort of delay in success because they haven't found their mental ability to take action. But I do feel like we have somebody here that's about to take action. They are going to be leaving behind a unstable situation where there's no success. They're giving up, holding on. This person has been overwhelmed, very overwhelmed with a lot of challenges. Maybe karma. Maybe they've been getting a lot of karma because they haven't been acting in integrity. But this is taking another step. Somebody's going to be taking another step, probably before the ship sails. Um, we have somebody that's been going back and forth as well. They've been trying to figure out what is the best option for financial success. And they've obviously had two, at least two choices, if not more, up to seven multiple options of cups is damn it the covers on the cup again <laughs> somebody is not giving their love very freely they're not we have some relationship problems here we have a, this is like a dying dream it is it's a dying dream we have somebody here that isn't I feel like this person isn't looking for a commitment so it's like it's time to say goodbye it, there's no love here there's no love there's no love it's, it's this is if you don't want a commitment then goodbye 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 and that's what it looks like to me giving up the fantasy giving up the illusion Becoming clear of a choice. Four of Wands. This is definitely about commitment. And it's upright. It is. It's definitely about commitment. Somebody is... is uh, exploring other options right now and they want happiness they want happiness and i feel like i feel like we have somebody here that it feels like they're intuitively being pulled you know their intuition is pulling them towards another choice Hierophant, that's a higher power. That's guidance. Hierophant is, is the, again, commitment, marriage. Somebody could be getting a proposal, too. I'm just going to change this up, and it's unpredictable. A minute, I had the high priestess in reverse on the bottom. There could be some sort of unpredictable proposal here that's coming in. There's some sort of divine guidance here. There's some sort of divine protection. We have somebody here that has a direct connection to God. There's been some sort of deception. Somebody's been lying. Somebody's gut is telling them the truth. They're telling them that this person is, you know, a sneaky, sly, 
liar. Somebody's gut is telling them that. There's protection here. Pay attention. Pay attention. Pay attention to your gut. Somebody has not been communicating, maybe because they were afraid of commitment. It's like they want to communicate, but they're, they, they, maybe they don't want commitment or they're afraid of commitment or they're afraid of marriage and they don't want marriage or something like that. Somebody, this is about marriage. It's about commitment. It's about a foundation. Somebody is leaving behind a foundation where there ain't no love. Okay. And that's the truth. Hierophant. Faith. Happiness with the Four of Wands. Somebody could be attending a get-together in the near future. And they run into somebody that... I don't know, maybe this person left them. This person left them. I don't know. Losing a battle. Somebody is losing a battle. They are. Letting go. Suddenly. There could be some emotions that are all over the place. There could be some tears that are shed. You know. Giving up. Giving up with the Nine of Wands reverse. Giving up. Somebody is giving up. They're choosing another option. Somebody could be leaving without saying goodbye. There could also be some unfinished business here. Okay. Lack of closure. Lack of success. No success. Flogging a dead horse. Staying in the present. Stuck in the present. Resisting change. I do believe that somebody is going to receive some emotional news. It is emotional, and I don't know what it is, but I think it's very emotional with the Ace of Cups reversed. Um, we may have somebody here that is making an escape as well with the Seven of Swords. They've been dishonest. You know, they're just ready. They're just ready to come clean. I feel like come clean is part of this as well. They're being guided to come clean. They're being guided to accept the truth, being guided to... Uh, follow their gut, follow their heart where the, they are. And it feels like there's some sort of emotional discontent, emotional detachment, or emotional un unavailability, which has caused some sort of extreme stress with that Nine of Wands, you know, trying to prove a point. Maybe somebody's been trying to prove something to society, you know. Got to stay put because... It's embarrassing. You know, Six of Wands reversed. I mean, upright. It's about public recognition. What's the opposite of that? Public embarrassment. No success. The world card reversed. That's lack of success. It is. It's time to explore other options. Eight of Cups. Goodbye. That is goodbye. We have somebody here been very confused, 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 confused about a commitment. Ten of Pentacles. Ten of Pentacles is abundance, flourishing, flourishing abundance, choosing abundance, choosing because I put it right on top of the Seven of Cups. Somebody is going to be choosing financial stability. They're going to be choosing something more abundant, extremely abundant. Something about a home. There could be a change in the residence. Change on the home front. We did have that Two of Pentacles. That was a change. That is a home front. 
right next to the four of wands that's a home as well there could be changes on the home front investing in a new home in a new living situation what I just saw was guided home because the Hierophant four of wands ten of pentacles Hierophant is guidance it is There is the ultimate abundance here with the Ten of Pentacles. But it requires somebody to choose it. You have to choose it. You have to choose it. You have to choose that abundance. You have to choose that. You can't choose illusion. You can't choose fantasy. You can't choose to not commit yourself. You have to, cho you have to commit yourself. You have to commit yourself to it. Because the, both the Hierophant and the Four of Wands are about commitment. And we have somebody here that hasn't been committed. If you want security and you want stability and you want the abundance, you have to commit. Making a decision to commit. That's what this is about. Good luck. 